What's up guys, today I'm going to show you the top 3 apps to watch movies and TV shows on your iOS 8 device. First we have Movie Box, which I presented already. This app is quite good in showing you what's new and what's uh, in the box office. It also has search functions, it also has filters, you can filter by rating, title, year, genre, whatever. They also have TV show section where you can search for TV shows or if you have already some favorite movies or TV shows you want to watch, you can do that as well, bookmark them and you can watch your favorite TV show again or watch the newest ones. You also have a download section. If you want to watch your movies and TV shows, you can download everything to your device if you're offline. And update section, I think they updated the links here. It doesn't say much about that. Frequently asked questions and order a movie if you want to watch something particularly. Let's jump into the next one. The next app is Playbox. Now the interface is somewhat similar. It's not exactly like the other one, but this one has the popular movies and the new movies. So you see popular movies were these ones, as you can see on the screen. And new movies, they added some new movies like here. You can check that out as well. Now jumping to the TV shows, I'm going to cancel that. TV shows as well, popular TV shows. You can see which are the popular TV shows watched on this app. And the new TV shows as well, same deal. Now here, you can choose a genre. And of course, searching movies and TV shows. Alright, we have... Uh, additionally we have cartoons here so you can see popular and new cartoons adult cartoons and kids cartoons whichever you want you might find your favorite cartoons from back in the day also we have animes these Japanese style cartoons as well all right and of course the favorites you can bookmark anything movies and uh, TV shows you have a download section you can download as well for offline use and the settings app. So you don't have much here. You can request a movie, report a problem, contact the people. You have the kids mode, uh, passcode lock for kids, for example. You don't want your kid to watch, uh, I don't know, uh, an X-rated movie or something. And you don't want your kid to stay too much watching cartoons, right? So local language and background download enabled and also for cellular. All right, and the third one, last but not least, we have the Kodi, formerly known as XBMC. Now, this particular app is very strong. It can even stream live TV. It also has YouTube radio and uh, live TV, as I mentioned. You can also have music, whatever music you have on your iOS device, you can stream that unfortunately for this you have to be jailbroken so this app does not work without a jailbreak the other two apps i presented are working with a jailbreak all right so let's jump right into it quickly to show you how this works if you're not familiar with this it also has an os 10 and a windows version so you can check those out uh, particularly the ios version is smaller as you can see my screen is a bit magnified here but in your palm of your hand it will show smaller and maybe a bit difficult to work sometimes but it's totally manageable with the skin you can see i have here some of my favorite shows for example csi cyber is a cool show to watch and all this for free without downloading and also this app what has uh, yes it has some bugs uh, obviously what this app can do is download uh, some subtitles straight to your movie or your TV show from an online source. So you don't have to search for it if you're watching a foreign movie or if you're one of those people who likes to have subtitles so you can understand everything what's going on in the movie or TV show, you can do that. Alright, as you can see here are the summaries for the TV show and whatnot. Alright, and uh, you can uh, also set up some stuff like if you need to use um, a proxy or something to access a certain uh, site or if your uh, ISP provider is blocking some content you can do that as well unblock it here 
uh, you have many many settings I'm not going to jump into that these are just the summaries of the top three apps that I used for watching TV shows and also with Kodi or the former XPMC live TV as well so hopefully you, you like my top three uh, apps and uh, give a thumbs up to this video and stay tuned for next episodes also guys if you like my videos make sure you check out my other videos i made on this channel and if you really like what i'm doing and you want to stay up to date with everything i do just hit the subscribe button and you will get notified of the latest updates